Hi guys, welcome to another video. Back on a different server, I created an account on the, uh, is that the global server that I'm on? Yes, yes it is. I, I think it's the global server, I'm not sure. I don't know. Anyway, um, <laughs> uh, I'm here with a blapping video. I can show you this one because I've just given my horse uh, Morpheus arms. Uh, so I'm going to show you my blapping process and it won't be clickbait where you have to sit there for half an hour. Uh, so this is what I do. While your horse is young, don't need to use any of these buttons when your horse uh, it hasn't isn't able to play. Because if you use these, then it is a waste of your resources and a waste of your time as well. So, groom, you're going to click play, you're going to go to the max amount. And then you're going to go carrot, feed, at six, at the required amount. And then you're going to go back to play, and you're going to do as much as you can. If it does come up with two, then you still want to do one, just in case. So confirm that, do the rest of the actions, bedtime, and then you can see here that my horse only has 23 energy. And if we were to try and play again with our horse, that would take up 5% uh, percent of our energy, which we can't do. So we're going to leave it at that. We're going to age again and do the process again. And you will see that gradually the amount of time you can play for increases so here you can see I've got two uh, I can play for one hour instead of half an hour but I'm still going to go half an hour just in case do the rest of the actions bedtime and now we can see that our horse has 26% energy left and if you go back to play for half an hour you can see that we can do that so click it age and repeat the process so now we're playing for the maximum amount um i don't oh i do have chronos timer don't know if it's worth it though i don't know if it's worth it putting a chronos timer on my horse because Obviously, if I've got, if I breed this mare with my stallion that I have, the foal obviously will become better, which is when I probably want to use my Chronos timer. And you always want to go back and check how much energy you have. So if you need to do more, uh, then you can do more. There we go. And now we can see all of the play is finished. So we don't need to do any of that. Don't need to do any of these. Put her to bed and age her again. And now she's fully grown. Next step is the rides. So you want to click uh, whichever whichever one, it doesn't matter which order you do it in. And you want to do one less than the maximum amount. So for me, that's five hours. Go riding, then you click all of the actions. And then you go back and then you do two less than the maximum amount. And that will still leave you with enough energy at the end. So your horse wakes up with the full amount of health, energy, whatever. And then you just repeat that. I usually do just focus on one, just so it's, I just feel like it's less complicated for me. <laughs> and then once again, if you have spare energy left over, you can see how much uh, half an hour takes. Here it's 8.1%, so we won't do it because my horse doesn't have enough energy. Yeah. 
yeah that time I did end up with less because I wasn't following my own instructions <laughs> okay uh, yeah so now it changes once again once you've got the training up now you want to do the full amount all of the actions because you have mash available now you can click that at the end of your day if your horse doesn't have enough energy so first you wanted to do the full amount and now you do one less than the full amount and then you feed your horse and you can see that my horse will need energy and then you should end up roughly about 22 percent energy each time and that is pretty static for all of it so full amount all of the actions, one less than the full amount, and then all of that. And again, it will be 25, 22% energy by the end of the day. I don't really like focusing on the missions at the top because it kind of wastes how much time you have and it doesn't really give you much like you can see 0.23 that's not not a lot And then once you have finished this, go on to the next one and repeat the whole process. <laughs> it should take you, I think, until... I'm not sure. I th I'd say within the three year bracket, unless I'm wrong. But I'm pretty sure that one does take quicker to finish than the other. Uh, once again, that could just be me. <laughs> and the process with this is basically the same as the process with training as well. Um, you just want to do full amount, all the actions, and then one less than the full amount, feed and mash. Uh, usually you can tell when you're getting close when the numbers are the second time around you do. Uh, hold on, let me show you. So this is the first time around we're going and God, I hate these notifications. Uh, and then this is the second time around we're going. You can see they're still on 3.2.2. Uh, you can usually tell if you're close to finishing when it says 1.1.1. Da da da. Um, the process of bluffing is also uh, sped up and made easier with BMI items such as Chronos Timers, Morpheus Arms. Um, if you're not using Morpheus Arms, it usually takes around 60 AP to bluff a horse without a Chronos Timer. Um, and then with a Chronos Timer around... 30 to 40 because obviously you've got all the competitions that you need to win uh, you need if you're kind of doing it on your own or on a team you I'd, I'd say you still do need fillers to fill the competitions for you uh, on this server I have noticed there aren't a lot of fillers or there aren't a lot of horses at least that are specifically named filler so it can be kind of hard to tell.
See we're close now to finishing. I don't like the new notification thing that horses has come up with. It's really annoying. It cuts off the, the top half of my page and I'm I'm blinded. Maybe it's six years old. Yeah, I'd say six years old is when it finishes, really. Five or six. I was completely wrong then. <laughs> I did have the number six in my head, but I thought it couldn't be right because it was so far away. But obviously. It's finished now. Uh, you can also note my skill bar is also really full. It actually it is not that full. I've just changed the uh, uh, skill bar. Let's, I'll put it to a thousand. Um, I won't show equipment on horses. <laughs> Um, and I put the MA on my female purely because of the wait time in between in between um, breeding. Obviously, if you put MA on a male, uh, I would say it's slightly less beneficial because males don't have to wait every time you breed them. Uh, also when you come to competitions uh, notice it, uh, the equestrian centres you put them in and what tack it provides because if you're starting out you obviously won't have that much tack uh, yourself. So I just keep your eyes open. You can use the toggle options um, at the top of the page to obviously help you find each equestrian centre that you want. Yeah, so with the training, uh, you've probably already seen it's full amount, uh, all of the actions once again, and then one less than the full amount, feed them, and mash. People who are very good at bluffing and have a lot of BMIs on their horse can usually finish this process within 10 minutes or so. Obviously we can't do that because we're not rich. <laughs> When you get towards the end of your training, you'll notice that giving the full amount is not worth it. So you can see as I click down, the number stays the same. So you want to find the exact place where it changes. So you can 
make the most of uh, your horse's energy. And then you can move on to the next one. Uh, if you're feeling lucky, you can also enter your horse into competitions at this point as well, purely because while they're training, they can still get wins. Uh, so for my Arabian, I've just looked at the top Arabians and they have, and they specialise in classical riding, so I'm going to specialise my horse in classical riding too, and it suits the equestrian centre I'm in because all of this is provided for me. Uh, where you can give your horse like um give your horse um pets equipment anything that will give them extra skills uh because that always helps mm -hmm. 